Hello everyone and welcome to Action RPG. I'm your host Aaron. And for today's video, we're headed to the world of a brand new co-op online isometric action RPG titled Aran the Book of Heroes. Now A-R-R-A-N can also be pronounced Aaron. I feel like I'm required to cover this game for more than one reason. Aran is a hack and slash co-op dark fantasy adventure with some RPG elements. Go through enemies solo or along with up to five players online in this dark dungeons and barbaric lands of Aran. Loot the unique equipment completing campaign quests where the final victory, victory is only for the skilled. Ooh, ah, this is a game that I've actually been following for a little bit. And now we have a playable demo. So I will link the Steam page in the description. This is not a sponsored video, not being paid, just playing it because I want to. Logging in to the Book of Heroes. We are now logged in. Let's play some Book of Heroes. And this is the main menu. We're going to go play. And here we are. Now, I've played this game for a little bit and I beat the first mission. So I do understand how the mechanics work. OK, you do use WASD as far as movement. And even though you have basic skills, there is a lot of skill that is involved with this game. It's not just hack and slash and you'll cut through everything. You got to block. You got to use your bow when you want or your secondary weapon. Now, when you come right here, you have different heroes and it cracks me up because it actually does remind me a little bit of D2 because you've got them all standing around the campfire and it's right here. You've got a druid, a shield maiden, a warrior, huntress and a barbarian. So far, my favorite class is the huntress. And then on here, you have your inventory, helm, two weapons, armor, and then you have a necklace. And I'm not sure what goes in this slot right here. And it shows that there is different rarity of weapons that you find. Chop, can't click on it. Progression, can't click on it. Quest selection. So we're going to do the omen. OK, and we've already beaten the north wind sewers. So now we're up to the forlorn hills. Click create. You're going to move up here and the quest starts in three seconds. The first quest actually took a long time, so I don't know if we're going to complete this, but at least you'll get some idea on gameplay. Now, I can just tell you in the short time that I've been playing this visuals feel good. It feels very smooth. I've had no problems as far as performance goes, but I do feel right off the bat that this is going to be a game that is going to be much more fun to play with friends. OK, so I got my basic attack. That's left click. I can right click to block. OK, you can hold your attack and you do a stronger attack and you can switch to your bow and shoot ranged. But right down here next to your bow, you will see that I am limited on ammo. So you only want to use your bow when you actually need it. But you do find arrows and potions and different things along the way. So let's take this for a spin. Come and get me multiple levels. So you can see we just dropped down. They do a nice job with shadows in this game as well. Uh oh. So as you can see, I already need to back up because if I don't. Oh, took one hit. Now, oh, where'd all your guys go? Okay, so first group of enemies done. He's bad. Oh, they're coming. They're everywhere. Oh, I blocked both of those hits. Now let's plot the bow for the next group of enemies. As you can see, the bow is absolutely awesome. But just with that encounter, we used 75% of all of our arrows. Now, normally you can kind of walk along the outside and you will find different things. I can't believe that skeleton hit us. Almost hit us twice. Get out of here. So over here, you got some coins. And this game does have a lot of loot that drops. Ugh. Get out of here, archers. 
Oh, now we're getting tore up. Okay, hold on. Oh! Almost half of our life is done from that one archer I just could not hit. It was defended very well. Don't worry, you will find healing potions along the way. Gotta break the shield. Use the strong attack. Get out of here. So those enemies are dropping loot and we are collecting it. All right, no potions yet. Oh, is that just the beginning? Ah, no one to protect you this time. Every once in a while, it does kind of feel like a hack and slash where I can just go in and tear things up. Ooh, a double attacker. And we are out of arrows. All right, let's see what we got. Destroy the gate. I'm guessing these enemies are not going to stop coming. Got it. Die. All right, so you see here, arrows on the bench. So now we are back to full and a potion. And we are back to almost full life. See, we're doing pretty good. Who else wants some? Now in the first round, I found a key. I have no idea what, I'm sure there's hidden chests or something. But I never actually used the key. Archer first. Alright. Alright, I used one of my abilities. Basically a way to generate threat. Mm, why is there so many bad guys? That worked well. You see what I mean about you just can't go in and just start swiping because you will get destroyed. That one. Oh, it's another gate? It's like, why do they keep coming? Ugh. Killed a big one. All right. Now just one at a time. See, we got this. All right. Got another potion. So this is a little shrine that's going to help me. There must be another gate. Oh, I see him on the map. Oh, there's map. Yeah, there's gates everywhere. All right, let's blow these up and then I'll show you that little thing, what it gives us. All right, one more. Leave one more. Die, big sword person. Got 
Gotcha. Let's get this final gate. I knew there was going to be arrows over here. That's why I used them all. All right. Now we can snag that potion. And I will show you this. So we have an arrow on the map of where to go. Come right here. Back to full life and an extra potion. So as of right now, we have our main skill. We have full life. The only thing we are missing is having lots of arrows. Oh, maybe I did. Did I not pick up these arrows? I thought I did. Let me just double check. I did not. Boom. So literally right now, we could not be doing better. Backup potion, full arrows, skill is ready, and max life. All right, so now we need to reach the mound. Oh, there's even more arrows there. Hmm. One thing I've noticed is sometimes it's like hard to hit single targets. Like it's very easy to miss. All right, took one little hit. When you kill archers, you can pick up their arrows. Now, one thing you also notice is there is no experience bar. No experience bar in this game. Hmm. I blocked your arrow. Blocked your arrow. shield I'm like really starting to get the hang of it hit hit block back up Say I'm getting the hang of it, then I look down and realize my life is just getting crushed. Alright, follow the arrow. Uh-oh. Let's go ahead and move out of that corner. See if we could thin the herd a little bit. our backup potion because we were getting crushed all right we're back to good these coins do they never give you a break thank you all right we're at the highlands Not so strong without your archers behind you now, are you? The 
see that? I like that combo, right? I say that and then we start getting crushed and we're out of arrows. All right, half life. Boom, just kidding. It always knows when I need a little boost in health. All right, heading. Uh oh. Corresponding stairs with a door. What does that mean? Great King Tomb. Inspect crate. No, just some gold. Let's see, do we got a fight on our hands now? Oh, more doors we gotta deactivate. Alright, we're gonna play. I said we'll play until we clear this room, but maybe we won't be able to clear it. Can you imagine if I could just shoot that whenever I wanted? Game would be too easy. Come on. One down. Looks like we took out the whole mountain already. Kill the freaking archer first. wondering how much so there's actually there's a couple characters that use a shield I'm wondering how much block they can do all right one more give me all this Come on. Ooh, escape. Maybe we're done. All right, I said we were done now. Potion. We're green. Now escape the tomb. I'm just going to run at this point. See what happens. I guess I'm going to let the archer shoot me. I have no idea if this is what we're supposed to be doing. I'm guessing probably not. Holy smokes. This is not smart. Give me that. Here, go fight that. Oh, I didn't pick up the potion. I thought I did. You notice that the archers, you can't, they just pick you off. Oh, we're gonna die. Nope. Quest ends in four. See, you saw a fully quest completed run. Didn't take too long. All right, what do we get? Ooh, it's glowing. Oyster's crown. All right, gold collected. 654. Enemies killed. 308. Air in action RPG. All right, we'll take a look at our crown really quick. Is right here. It is a mythic helmet. Ooh, look at that. It actually shows up on our character. We now have a mythic 
helmet that we got for our reward at the end of that run. So that's the game. What do you think? Obviously, indie studio, obviously in development. It is actually dropping late 2023, so it's got a lot of time to cook in the oven, but I love the name. Visuals feel good, and the fact that it's got co-op online up to five players, as of right now, I am sold. I want to know your opinion. Could you see yourself? Could you see this game being fun? Or what do you think it needs? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Two asks at the end of this video. Ask number one, I'm hoping today's the day I have earned your subscription. Hoping today is the day you make the decision to push that little red button. I would really appreciate it. It really does help the channel as we come to the end of 2022. Ask number two, check out my Patreon. Thank you to the first 51 members that have signed up. Become an instant ARPG VIP and get Patreon exclusive content at the first link in the description. Weekly blog post, weekly podcast, access to the VIP lounge so you could chit chat with me every day. Chance to win custom merch, special title, and lots of goodies depending on where you sign up at. Again, first link in the description. It is the best way to support me. You are all awesome. Hopefully you're entertained or at least learn something. Aaron, out. Mm -hmm.